is Shining Fates Crow Bad Box. So that is what we are going to do this week. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please subscribe if you have not yet. And do not forget to hit the thumbs up button down below. But let's get started. I am so excited to get into this. There are so many packs in this box. And if you've seen my other Shining Fates videos, I haven't had the greatest luck yet. So I'm really hoping this is my go-to box. So, without further ado, let us dive right into it. I'm going to open it back here because... a jumbo card too of the VMAX. Let us start with the big Charizard boy for our first artwork pack here. Let us dive right in. this card. 
I feel like everyone has it already. And the final card. <laughs> the artwork on this. It's very cute. <laughs> what the heck? It just looks like a normal box. Okay, well that is a great start for us. Super excited about that. Alright, the next pack then. Pack number two. Seriously, check out my last two tins if you want to see some not so good luck. <laughs> so, if this video makes you want to buy some shiny baits, just be wary. They are not all like this. <laughs> Alrighty. Let us see what we keep getting. Let's keep getting some good stuff out. yet, I don't think. In this set. <laughs> we got a shield. We got Dartrix. Gossiflua. Coffin. Morpeko. Yanima. Warsi. Alrighty, there's our first non-shiny. Oh my god. Our cards that are non-hollow in the rare spot are dry. 
Then there were two packs remaining, everybody, two, just two packs. We will save the Charizard till the end.